Hi and welcome to this video on the King James Bible Code. Here you see an image of the empty tomb and in this image are some Hebrew letters and these Hebrew letters form a name, but more on that later. I do have a video on the 666th verse of the Bible or the Old Testament and I'll put a link to that video in the description. We will be using the King James Pure Bible Search software. Download that for free at purebiblesearch.com. I encourage you to get the software and verify the numerical patterns I'm going to show you for yourselves. Let's begin in the 660th chapter of the Bible, Ecclesiastes 1. The words of the preacher, the son of David, king in Jerusalem. Did you know that the word Ecclesiastes means the preacher? And here, using this cipher where we count by nines, where A equals 9 and Z equals 234, the word preacher has a value of 666. And the book of Ecclesiastes contains the 666th chapter of the Bible. And we will go there at the end of this video. Revelation 13, 18. Here is wisdom. Let him that hath understanding count the number of the beast, for it is the number of a man, and his number is 603 score and 6. In the King James Bible, the word man, case sensitive as it occurs in this verse, and the word number combined for 888. We will see the significance of this uh, number here shortly. But we are interested in the number 666. So let's go to the other 666 verse in the Bible, which is John chapter 6, verse 66. From that time, many of his disciples went back and walked no more with him. And what was the reason for this? They could not understand the parable of eating his flesh and drinking his blood. 666 is encoded here in the King James Bible because the phrase from that, the word time, the phrase many of his, the phrase disciples went back, the phrase and walked, and the phrase no more with him combined for 666 occurrences in the King James Bible. I have a video demonstrating the 666 patterns contained in John chapter 6, which happens to be the 74th chapter of the New Testament, and I'll put a link to that video in the description. And the Bible tells us that Jesus taught in parables, and the word parables has a value of 603 score and 6, like the word preacher. Let's go to John 6, 67, Then said Jesus unto the twelve, Will ye also go away? Now the word 12, case sensitive, as it occurs in this verse, occurs 74 times in the New Testament of the King James Bible. Now the word Jesus has a value of 74 using a simple ordinal English cipher, and we are in the 74th chapter of the New Testament. Now the name Jesus, as it occurs in this verse, in the Greek Textus Receptus is shown here, and it has a value of 888, and 888 is 74 times 12. I forgot to mention we are taking the scenic route to the 666th verse of the New Testament, but let us go to the Old Testament where the number 666 occurs, and that is in Ezra chapter 2 verse 13. In Ezra chapter 2 verse 13, we are told that this individual, Adonikam, has 660 and 6 children. In Nehemiah chapter 7 verse 18, we are told that this same individual has 603 score and 7 children. And I believe that the reason for this can be found in the 667th chapter of the New Testament. But let's look at the meaning of the name Adonikam. It means, My Lord has risen. This name is formed from two other words, one which means Lord and the other word which means to rise up or stand. The Hitchcock's Dictionary of Bible Names gives the meaning of the name as the Lord is raised. Armed with this knowledge, let's go to Matthew chapter 20. Let's pick it up in Matthew chapter 20, verse 17. And Jesus, going up to Jerusalem, took the twelve disciples apart in the way and said unto them. Now the name Jesus in the New Testament narratives, which are the four Gospels in the book of Acts, occurs in 666 verses. This is not counting the six occurrences of Jesus all capitalized. If we count those six mentions, the total becomes 672, which is 666 plus 6. And one of those mentions is referring to Joshua, and the name Joshua has a value of 603 score and 6, as you see here. That mention is in Acts chapter 7, verse 45, but the name Joshua has a value of 603 score and 6. And not only that, Joshua is the sixth book of the Bible, and the name Joshua contains six letters. And the name and the name occurs 216 times in the Bible, and that is 6 times 6 times 6. Now let's go to the 666th verse of the New Testament, which is Matthew chapter 20, verse 18. Behold, we go up to Jerusalem, and the Son of Man shall be betrayed unto the chief priests and unto the scribes, and they shall condemn him to death. Now the phrase, shall be, occurs in 666 chapters of the King James Bible. And if we narrow the scope to the New Testament narratives, the four Gospels in the book of Acts, the word shall occurs in 666 verses. If we combine the word shall with the phrase condemn him, the verse count remains 666 because the phrase condemn him always occurs with the word shall. And the 667th verse of the New Testament reads, And shall deliver him to the Gentiles to mock and to scourge and to crucify him, and the third day he shall rise again. 
The phrase shall rise combined with the word again, and that word again being case sensitive, that's why it's underlined, combined for 666 in the King James Bible. And what does the name Adonikam mean? My Lord has risen. Let's finish this video. Let's go to the 666th chapter of the Bible, Ecclesiastes chapter 7, verse 1. A good name is better than precious ointment, and the day of death than the day of one's birth. Now the word precious and ointment combined for 74 in the Old Testament, and the name Jesus has a value of 74. And the phrase, good name, like the name Jesus, both have a value of 603, score and 6, using the cipher based off the number 9. Let's look at verse 25. I applied mine heart to know and to search and to seek out wisdom and the reason of things and to know the wickedness of folly, even of foolishness and madness. And the word know, case sensitive, the word search, the word seek, case sensitive, and the phrase out wisdom combined for 666 in the King James Bible. Verse 27. Behold, this have I found, saith the preacher, counting one by one to find out the account. This is the 666th occurrence of the word behold in the King James Bible. And the word preacher has a value of 603 score and 6 using the same cipher that the name Jesus has a value of 603 score and 6. And Jesus was a preacher. Let's continue. Verse 29. Lo, this only have I found that God hath made man upright, but they have sought out many inventions. And man is an upright creature unlike the beast, which is a four-footed animal and goes about on all fours. For example, a lamb is a four-footed clean beast. In Revelation 13, 18, the beast there being referred to is the lamb. Look at the next verse, Revelation 14, 1. Notice what else it says here. They have sought out many inventions. Most of what is taught about the number 666 are the inventions of man. This short video is meant to be a demonstration of the King James Bible Code. If you like this video, please hit the like button and consider subscribing to my channel. God bless and bye for now.